Hello everyone, it's about time we did some more horror. The convenience store is a new Japanese style horror game. That. Okay, that's that noise makes me feel very <laughs> uncomfortable. The game thinks it's crashed, but the noise is changing. So it's, it's not crashed. We're, we're here. Uh, down, S. It's time. Need to get ready for work. Okay. WASD and interacting. Alright, so. Konnichiwa. <laughs> hey? Okay. Is that my pet mouse? Or what's that? It is dark outside. You're right. You're absolutely. Wow. Good thing to know our character's smart. Alright, we're gonna have a. I've got to bring the flashlight. Where is the flat? Where do you keep your flashlight in Japan? Uh, down here? No. Where, where could it. Is it on the table? Where's the flashlight? There it is. Uh, yes. Yes, there we go. Okay. Time to head to the convenience store. I uh, which is I'm assuming our, our job. I need to ease I think change and grab a flashlight. Okay. But let's eat something. Fridge. No. Cook. Can we cook? Let's not cook. Okay. Uh change. How do I change? Wardrobe. That is closing, doesn't it? There we go. Let's change clothes. Step one to going outside. Now let's eat some snacks, some noodles, or, or not. This fridge, this microwave. What does it want me to eat? Um, nothing there. Do I have any leftovers anywhere? Do you want leftovers? In here? No? That, that, eat the trash? Oh, there we go. Are we gonna eat some cake? Do we put it in the microwave? Yes. Warm food before going out into the cold night and keep that fridge shut. Shut all the doors so we don't get snuck up on. Is it done? There we go. Eat bento. Yeah, I don't know what bento is, but we're going to eat it. And now, I've never been ex so excited to go to work in my life. Head downstairs to the convenience store. So if you've never played a Japanese horror game before, <laughs> same. I'm not sure what's going to be different about it, but I've seen it, it's about an hour long. You've seen how long it is by the left of the video. <sighs> it's very, very dark though. And I don't know where the convenience store is. Down, down here. Okay, no one's following me. No. Okay. Wait, are there stairs? Okay, I can sprint slightly. Okay, no, we can't go that way. Is this the store? That's not the store. Okay. Just looking for some sort of direction on where to go, which there probably is, and I've probably just missed, but we'll work it out together. I really can't see anything at all, though. Oh, here. Yes. Okay, this would be a horrible place to walk to work at night time. Oh, I fell. <laughs> so you fall like that, and then suddenly, broken ankle, middle of the night. What are you going to do? 
the convenience store. It's got to be a place with lights on. Why are we doing a night shift? Is it like a quickie mart? An Asda? A Walmart? 24 hours. But everywhere else seems to be shut. No one's about. So we won't even get any customers. Here we go. Crossing the bridge. Let's not do a PewDiePie. I know. Oh, that looks nice. I'm going to hate how deserted it is. That's going to be horrible in about five minutes. But at least we've got like an aim to go now. Oh, hello. Are you you alright? I know what really happened here. I was called to warn you all. By the name I cannot speak of, the day of judgment will come. Oh yeah, what the fuck? Okay. Why? why? That was all good until you like, screamed at me. Hello. Hey, Roger! I'm gonna walk around before I speak to you because that guy just freaked me out and I don't know why. Okay, so we've got a storeroom back here. Ice cream and noodles and beer. And then this is a back door. So that's a. Oh, I'm not liking this. I am not liking this at all, no. Okay, big balls, big balls, big balls. We've got some toilets over here. Okay, <laughs> that that didn't scare me. <laughs> Thank you for always keeping the toilet clean. Okay. I don't, I don't like that toilet noise. That <laughs> not a fan. Hey, Roger. Yes, of course I made it. Yeah, I, I, I did fall on the way here. What? Are you, are you good, Raj? Can I come in? Yes, let's enter the counter. Do we get to work together? So I won't be on my own. Yay! Me and Roger on the shift. Sorry? I uh, punch in. Okay, how do I do this? Here? That's a microwave. Here? Punch. That's like noodle stuff. That's a till. Uh, this is that my punching? Yep, punching. No. Punching. Yes. The point of no return. Oh, uh, no. Roger, come back. Please. Don't leave me. Roger, don't go. Don't go. Oh no. Okay. As long as we're back here, we're going to be safe. Got our first customer pulling up. Unless it's just Roger fucking off. No, we got a customer. Okay. We got a baseball bat. Oh, nope. Okay. So it's a customer. What's this in the back? Okay. Hello? Hiya. How are you doing, sir? How may I help you? Is that another one? Please do not steal. Stealing is bad. Okay, I think that's Roger leaving. Okay, you've got a big box of something. I'm not sure how this is gonna work. <laughs> it's very different to anything I've ever played before, but I'm I'm all here for it. Once he's gone, I'll probably start getting all the expired foods. Oh, this is <laughs> the atmosphere. The music's gonna go off at some point, and that is gonna make me shook. If come on, mate, you can make it. 
I believe in you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hello. How are you? Oh, here. Yes? Okay, is that... I didn't think that was how shops work. Maybe in J Japan it's different. So some stuff is out of date and expired. Is this expired? Thank you, Rabbi Carrot Juice. Is that why you're gonna have like high hallucinations? <gasps> Anime! Woohoo! I rarely buy magazines, but I do buy Austin. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Oh, ice cream. There we go. I'm gonna check the CCTV right now. See if anything dodgy is going on. I hope not. But we have to go and have a look. Okay, so we... That's around the back. So we've got two in the store, one at the front and one at the back. Okay. How do I get out? Escape. So that's how it's all gonna work. Hello? Who came in? I'm guessing that was a glitch and it's not like an invisible ghost or a corpse crawling on the floor. Okay. <laughs> The door's just broken. Do I have to go fix the door? Thirteen bucks a night shift. Sorry? Oh, thirteen bucks an hour a night shift. I, I, I respect the hustle. Okay, I'm sure someone just pulled up. Are you still around here? Uh, man. Hello? Can I get past? I, I can't, I literally can't leave. Okay, he's still here. Bring me food. Or you will receive eternal punishment. Oh, oh, I guess I'll bring you food. <laughs> you know, I was more likely to bring you food before you threatened me. But I'll do it anyway. Can I take some food? What food do you want? Looks like some are expired, okay. This shelf looks fine. This shelf looks fine. Can I give him the expired food? Yes. Let's give him the expired food because he threatened me and you should not... If you want someone to help you, threatening them is just not the way to, to go. There you go. You're welcome. Wait, what What are you doing? Why are you following? Dude? Okay, he's leaving. He's leaving. Good. Asshole. Okay, so we've got the achievements of the expired food and helping the homeless. And I... The only other achievements are the endings. So I, I'm really curious to see what would, you know, what's gonna happen. We can't be, you know, what's going on? Is there anyone hiding around the back? Oh, I don't like that. What happened there? Was that me? Okay. Store's fine. Fine. Front's fine and no one's round the back. We seem to be okay. No, we are okay. Let's believe this. Positiveness. We've had one customer. What time is it? Is there a clock? Is that at the time in microwave? Hand sanitizer? Coronavirus? No. I don't know what else to do right now. Should we... 
So we've helped the homeless man. We've... Can we go home? We can't go home. Can you imagine though? Okay, I don't know your life stories obviously, but if any of you have been homeless or if you thought about being homeless before, if you if someone was working at a shop, would you say could you please spare me some food? Or would you ask them or tell them, if you do not give me food, you will be punished eternally? Just just a question. Okay, we're all good out there. Let's shut that door. And that door's gonna stay shut all night, isn't it? No one's gonna open it. Oh, do we put this in the bin? Let's put it in the bin. In the bin. Yes. I've taken it off the shelf, so you're welcome. Oh, maybe I restocked the shelves. So we need some fish and some ham. I, I guess, from what I can make out. So what have we got back here? Some drinks, some ice cream. I currently work in a shop, so I should be able to do this. No, that's not that's not happening. Okay. Maybe we go and put it in the actual like dustbin outside. Let's try that. Something's beating in my body, and I don't think it's a like my heart. Why does this game give me something? <laughs> Uh, maybe I'm just hungry. I've recently started a new uh, bulking diet of meal, like ordered meal prep for the first time. And it's really helpful. I've cut down my cooking and eating times in a day for maybe like three to four hours cooking and eating and washing up. To like. There we go. Oh, there's the bin. <laughs> Don't let her. To maybe around half an hour. Yes, there we go. So a lot of attention to detail. It's not just disappeared. But I'm hoping that it's just attention to detail, and it's not like a a transitional going to come out. It's going to be a demon in the store, and he's going to like eat my face. Okay, we seem to be good on that face-eating part. And we got a customer, a truck driver. That can either be really good or really bad. It's a horror game, so I'm worried. But at the same time, we don't judge. Is he coming in? Okay, he seems to have a delivery. Let's take his delivery. Hello, sir. We've recently incorporated the system exclusively for convenience stores that stay open late at night. Looks like this package is directly shipped to this store. Oh, and the name matches your tag. I think this is for you. Uh, thank you. It says from that homeless man. Take it. No. Yes. Okay. Oh, we, is that it? Shift over. What the? Excuse me. Okay. What the? It's a VHS tape. Let's put it in the TV. Okay, watch closely. Why watch it closely? Why can't I watch it far away? Uh, 
Um, okay. So someone's recording around the store. Is that right? Now what? Do I go and go, do I go to work again? Another day, another grind. That was all intro. That was all. That wasn't even the scary bit. Oh, oh no, we're only 20 minutes in. I thought we were like 50 minutes in. It's gonna be like Five Nights at Freddy's. Wait, where am I? I'm here, okay. Um, I'm lost again. So we were delivered a VHS tape. That showed someone at the caution tape in the back. So, I'm going to say we watch the CCTV a bit more closely. <sighs> yeah, okay. Let's let's do that. Assuming we make it to work. We got to tell Roger about this though. We need to get to work and we need to tell Roger that someone is being spoopy. It's crazy dark right now. This torch. Do we not sell torches at the convenience store that we can get colleague discount on? Like this, this torch is poor. Like, I don't know where I am. Down this way. Nope. That round here. Okay, we're back on the main road. Kinda. Can we get back on the main? There we go. Let's go round the fence. That might help. The, oh, it's a light. It's a light. Oh, oh. Here we go. Okay, we're on the bridge. We're not going to come one day and find a guy with his legs bent backwards, are we? Is the homeless man still here? No, okay, he's still gone. Okay. Roger. Hiya. Hey, hey. So I heard you report that the doors would open on their own. Yes! The wire. Okay. <laughs> so. Yes, it was. They're not. No, they're not real. Why did you say that? Why did you have to say that? Roger. <laughs> Why? Okay, uh, punch in. Now it's gonna start. I'll see you later, Roger. Right, what are our orders today? Some rats behind the store. Okay, that's our job. We need to get rid of rats. How do we get rid of rats? Can we see anything on the CCTV around the back? No, I ain't going out after seeing that videotape. What the heck? Okay, why did you do that, Mr. Dude? Filming is one creepy thing. You know, tipping over the bin, that's just vandalism. Rats ain't tipping over that bin. Wait, is that is that Roger leaving or is that someone coming? Hello? I'm not judging. You just walk very creepily. Go on. It's a little old lady. She fine. She'd be fine. Okay.
she just walked through that door. I feel like I should be cleaning the rats while she's in here, but the way she's walking, it's building suspense because something's going to happen. You know, that toilet's going to come alive or, you know, something. Maybe I just don't sort the rats out and get fired. That way I don't have to deal with all this shit. 13 bucks an hour is great when someone's not secretly recording you. You don't want to be one of these people that just comes in the store to use the toilets and then leaves. I mean, if you need to go, you need to go, but at least buy a packet of crisps or something, you know? Where, where, where's she gone? She has just come in to use the toilet. Well, that's suspense. For the... T she's... Is she not going to come out? Mammy, you alright? Okay. Nothing yet. I'm predicting that we're going to have to... You know, she's not going to come out. But hey, I, I hope I'm wrong. Okay, is this the rat stuff? Here we go. Time to kill some rats, there's one. Where's the next rat? And who's there? Okay, I think someone wants to be served. Maybe, or it's just glitching through the wall. I can't see any more rats right now. Must sit around the side. Hello, rats. Little ratty poos. Okay, someone's here. This has got a weapon now. That's kind of nice. Hey, bro. Sorry, I'm here. Yes. I'll, one second, sir. Apologies. Can I help you? Can I help you? Sir? Do I have to finish the rats first? I guess I'll do the rats first. He doesn't want to talk to me. There's one there. Yes. Okay, so they do seem to be around here. There's one. No, it's not. I'm going to turn my brightness up a bit more. Just so I can see. Sorted. Bye bye, camera person. I'm going to run away now. I'll see you in a bit. That's the job done. So now we've got sunglasses and toilet lady. Hey, I'm in a hurry. Now could you please fetch me five cans of beer and a pack of cigarettes? Okay, sir. Sorry, forgot you were the most important person in the world. Okay, but I'm not actually telling him to get it himself. I do I have to do it one at a time? This guy's a dick, you know. Why are you making me do your shopping for you? You're in a hurry. So you're going to let or make someone who's got a million other things going on. Like... 
someone stalking them, a bunch of rats, an old lady that's been in the toilets for two and a half hours, running a store on their own, and it's going to take three times as long. What is your problem? I realise there's probably a basket, but, like, I'm four beers deep right now, there's no point. This dude, this dude, I can relate so much. As someone that's, you know, worked in retail for over a year, there are people like this, and it's, it's, it's weird, you know. Live your life how you want to live it, but be mindful of it. Let's just remember that. There we go. That's a million pounds, please, sir. Thank you. There we go. That's everything done now. I'm going to check that no one's out the back. Now we've sorted the rats out. No, it's all good. It's all good there. We're all nice and peaceful. We're loving life. It's a horrible way to leave orders though. Like, the first person to read this. <gasps> She's out. <laughs> you made it. Are you okay? Do you need help? Ma'am? Where's Kencon? You know where Kencon is? I thought I heard his voice. This was my daughter's house. What? What? Hey! Oh, now she's going fast. Excuse me? Okay, I need a, I need a weapon. Give me a weapon. Give me a weapon for this old wench. Okay, no, no, never mind. She's harmless. <laughs> Yeah, she's just leaving. It's fine by me. See you in a bit. Bye. And now I'm guessing Delivery Man's going to come with a new tape for me. So she's clearly, she's either got Alzheimer's, or there's actually like a ghost or something in here. So I'm gonna check the toilet. I can hear. Shush toilet. Hello? Not again, no. But the wiring's been fixed. Oh, no. Hiding. I'm a bit. I'm gonna monitor the store on CCTV. I pushed the wrong button. Yes, let's use it again. What the? Excuse me? It's a little kid. It's a little kid fucking with me. That's all it is. It's just a little f piece of shit kid. Where's he gone? Okay, delivery driver. I was literally about to say we've not found a use for the CCTV yet, but there we go. It's not a portal, guys. It's a little kid being a shitbag. You know, where are his parents? I don't know, do you know? Are you his parents? Are you the kid? I hope you're not the kid. 
Hey, PT Bay, PTP. Yo, you not got a parcel for me today? Good to see you. Hey, you too, Pete. Oh, you know, the unstoppable trend of on ordering everything online. Anyway, there seems to be a package that needs to be picked up here. Okay. Uh, oh, here. There you go, sir. Have a, have a great rest of your day, Pete. Rest of your night. Rest of your life. Hopefully it's long. If you want it to be long. See him drive away nicely. Okay, and he's gone. Okay, that's hoping that's everything now. We've had PT come back. We've solved the doors. We've got the rats. Toilet lady's gone. Customers sorted. Any other orders? Anything else? Any other jobs? Any other thing you want me to do? It's it's midnight. It's bang on midnight. Okay. How can we never mention to Roger about the CCTV? Like we literally had someone filming us last night and delivering it to me by name. Like why are the police not involved? Why is the manager not involved? Why is Roger not involved? Why didn't we tell Pete? Who is Pete? Can we even trust? Maybe it's Pete. You know, what do we do now? Do we have to track down this little kid? That's been running around? Hiding there? Nope. Is that a car pulling up? No? Hello, anyone around? I hate that noise so much. Okay, that's it. I don't like that noise though. Second night, okay. No videotape that time. That's sick. What the heck? Oh, it's raining, okay. Okay, we got a knock on the door this time. PT, is that you? You're not telling me that this is... They've not found my house now. I know that's not true. Then again, if they got my full name when, where I work, then why wouldn't they? You've got an umbrella up his... What are you doing? Put the umbrella off. We got bad luck. Oh, we're going to get the bad ending because we got the umbrella up. He's just recording my house now, or or she, or it. I reckon it's Roger, you know. I definitely think it's Roger. What time is it? It's twenty-five to twelve. It's our shift, half an hour. We're risking our life for six quid. Whoa, okay, that audio is spooky. Shut the door, I can't shut my own door. Well, okay, we're, we're getting murdered. <laughs> Let's 
try and figure out how to get to work this time. The brightness has made it a bit better, but it is also raining now. Hello? Follow the yellow brick road, and then we'll get to the store. Slowly leading my way around Japan. Let's play. I I would not like to lip it. <gasps> the bridge again. Okay. I'm still waiting for that guy with the with the legs or you know. Okay, he's not there. Roger. Roger. Well, I'm early. I fucking hate you, Roger. I fucking hate you. <laughs> oh, I hate Roger. Someone's gonna do it again, and we're gonna be like, oh, it's Roger. Let me just get my heart right back into the room. You know, currently it's up on... On Mars. Some products were missing on the shelf. Always keep the shelves full. That's our motto. Yeah. Wait, Roger. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, let's start straight away working this stock. Now, that's gonna happen tomorrow. Roger's not gonna be here. We're gonna be like, oh, okay, he's hiding. And then there's gonna be a bang, a boo. And it's gonna be like, oh, Roger. And it's like, no, it's Roger's dead body. I don't know, I keep predicting stuff. <laughs> and it's not right. I'm gonna stop. Okay, what? Where did these go? Here. Yes. That's the beef jerky restocked. What else do we need to restock? Okay, that's a that's a car. Now what the with with locked in? What the heck? Maybe I can... What the... Who's there? Hello? I heard you come in. I am not liking this at all. Okay, let me stock this back up on the shelf. Wherever it goes. Okay, I can just drop it. Okay. I'm gonna go and serve my boy instead. Sup, Slim. 
I'm Hamada. Oh, sorry, Hamada. So there's something wrong with the air conditioning. Your boss seemed desperate in keeping the food fresh. Hate to be working this late, but he pays me well, you know? Don't mind me. I'll just quickly check the outside units and head right out, okay? Please don't, you know, vanish. So, at least we're not alone. <laughs> Let's check up on our matey outside. How's he getting on? I'm sure he's doing great. He's getting that caution tape has been ripped through. What, who, and it's come. Okay, but our body's done. By the looks of it. Okay. And we got a customer. It's about to have a customer and a ham Hamida here. Hello, can I help you? Okay, you're doing some shopping. That's nice. Someone's doing their own shopping. <laughs> Hello, can I Oh, is that it? He's, he's just doing that and going. Yeah, I don't know if he was actually here for the air conditioning. It's just a, a hunch. Where did she go? Where did, where did she go? There she is. Okay. Let's not get paranoid. Hi, how are you? Hey. I can't believe this. What kind of a manager puts a girl on a midnight shift alone? You can stay with me if you want. I see you have no choice. But at the very least, I'll give you my protection charm. Oh, thank you. I'll be careful. Aw, oh, you're nice. Do I have to take it? I just don't know. It might be cursed. It might, it might be cursed, but it also might not be. I'm just thinking endings. What choices have I had? You know, what actual choices have there been? I'm just paranoid, I'm just paranoid, you know. Have a look outside. Anything else happened? At least the bin's standing up again. That's all good. We just need to find this last bit of stock. Not there. What the heck was that noise? Is that the toilet? No, no! Stay huge! It's not Roger. Are you serious? Dude, what? This stupid fucking kid. Hello? No. I'm Okay, this is just ramped up from zero to a hundred real, real quick. Okay, big deep breaths.
I think I'll take the protection charm. No. <sighs> okay. We're doing fine. We'll pick up the talismans. And then we're going to call in sick for work tomorrow, right? What, do we sell these talismans or are we like putting them somewhere? I'm a bit confused on that one. What about this? Okay, I can't tidy that. Your manager, don't know if I said it before, but that time, that time it was in a speech marks or quotation marks. I'm pretty sure the other two times it was not. Here we go. Definitely did not have to look that up. And now let's just wait for Petey to come back. Big Pete. Pete, Pete. No idea what to do with these talismans. It's time to explore the outside. I'm assuming there's no more stock left in here. No, I got it all. I'm gonna go see what ha Hamalan. Ham Hamalan. Himalayan. That didn't scare me. It's rain. wrench yes it's broken did Himalayan sabotage us got a key hello what the heck Okay, let's not go and do that then. If it feels like someone's grabbing you. <laughs> I'm gonna feel safer going around. The front way. Where there's room to run away. If I have to. take the protection charm out there we're gonna take that protection charm and the talismans don't know which ones we're gonna we're gonna need and we're gonna head to that door outside and hopefully that'll help us go through and if not we might just get the bad ending but we might also get the good ending you know equal chance that rain doesn't scare me every time I don't know what you're talking about Go through here. Exercise the door, yes. What? Okay, um, that's a four. I don't know what's going on, but I hate absolutely every second of it. No. No, no, you are not. I hate this. I absolutely hate it. And now we're on to the third night. I've been playing for over an hour. The game's only meant to be 40 minutes long. Is that a videotape? Okay. Shut that door. What's this tape gonna be? 
Why are we going back to work if the manager's dead? Let's watch it again. So it was the shop and then it was our house. Now what? I can't even see where that is. No idea. What on was it all the tree? I'm gonna go with n n no. Probably. I heard something unlock there, I think. Was it my door? No, okay. It's time to go back to oh, why do we still have this job? This is the fourth night. Why are we still here? Just to suffer? Sorry, what jump scares have there been, really? Like, I, I make jumping out as a, a, a scary face on CCTV. We can get through this. We, we have what it takes. Don't you even worry yourself. We're gonna finish this. If I could see. Okay, so I believe it was just this way, right? Like I said, really need a new torch. Okay, still no man on the bridge. That's great. What did I say? Roger's not here. Why is Roger? Why is Roger not here? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? He didn't jump out at me. There's no note. Of course there's no note. There's no check-in. CCTV. Okay. We're going straight out right now. What do you mean? What is this? Okay. Now let's check the CCTV. <laughs> I feel like this might be the finale. There's no one want to buy anything. Okay. Well, I mean, this is not what I was expecting. It's that little kid again, that little pooey kid. And there's no CCD out the back. Wait, where's he got? I just saw him again. There he is. He's going up and down all the aisles. Which mean he was right here. Okay. I think we have to go to that house. We can't. Okay. We can't go back out to that. Why did we turn up? When Roger wasn't here, why did we not just turn around? You know, what? What is our problem? Why do we do this to ourselves? 
Even the manga's judging us. Okay. The toilet seat doesn't even respond to us anymore. Can we go outside? We can't go outside. I guess we just gotta watch the CCTV. Some more. Just watch the kid do his own thing in CCTV land. There he is. Okay. He's looking at something. What do you want? What do you want, dude? You can't just keep stopping and looking at stuff. They're disappearing when I come out. Don't tell me you're just going to do the whole thing again. He's just going to keep walking around. He's just not going to stop. Yo, kid. He looked. Oh, wait. Oh, there's TVs. So we need to turn the TVs on where... He looks, maybe? So he looked there, I think. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can reset it by looking at the CCTV. Don't know if that's gonna work. But I think we're gonna have to turn on the ones that he... The four that he is looking at. That didn't reset it. I guess we just gotta go for it then. Go for that one. And I guess one more in this aisle. No. Maybe that's our chance to try again. And then we have this one. There we go. Got you. Caught you. Well, why have you been doing this, kid? What the fuck? Why? <laughs> I was comforting him. Okay. That's it. That's all gone. No. Oh, a customer. No? Oh, not another one of these. Right, okay. Okay, videotape. Throw it away. Send it off to someone else. Or watch it. The final choice. Telltale, what do we do? Throw it away. And quit a job and leave. Send it off to someone else so the cycle repeats. Or put it on and find our ending. Oh, what do we want? Closure, safety, or shift the problem. You know what? It's our problem. The videotape was above our house. Yes, I'm sure. Let's watch the tape. Oh, you bastard. I'm gonna guess that means I got the bad ending. Q. 
curiosity killed the cat. But what killed the wetty? Right, I can't move. You're right, I can't move. I can't do much. Just waiting for the impending jump scare. I'm braced. Oh. Well, that fucking sucks. That was a convenience store. I expected that to be 40 minutes like everyone said. Hour and a half. Hour, hour and a half. Did you not like that ending? Did you want the other one? You think I should have thrown it in the bin, don't you? Well, next time, you can play the game. Let me know what you thought of that. That It is only £2. So it's, you know, if you want a horror game to pass the time, go for it. It's... I was expecting just working a convenience store, getting some dodgy customers in. I did not expect a little crime boy, a big seven foot Hagrid demon, my manager to be killed, then come back to life, Roger to fuck off halfway through, Pete to disappear on me. I thought me and Pete had a thing, we didn't. Oh. And what happened at the end? I was in bed. And then I woke up, and I couldn't move, and then I died. Feel free to check it out. I'm probably not going to go get the other ending, unless you really want me to. <laughs> I hope you'll have an amazing rest of your day, and keep smashing it.